Hello and welcome to Kinetic Circus Workshop's Mr. Paul's Tutorials! This is Contact Juggling the Basics. Now before we start with the tutorial, I'm going to introduce you to... Oh, hello there! I'm going to introduce you to the different kinds of contact ball. This is a stage ball. It is squishy and lightweight. This is an acrylic. It is heavy and difficult to use. When you're starting off, use the lightweight squishy ones because when you drop them, they're going to bounce. If you drop an acrylic, they will bounce, but they will also get scuffed and chipped and look horrid. So always practice with a stage ball. Now I've been doing this for a bit, so I'm going to use an acrylic one. Also they look cooler. Now let's talk about the different kinds of grip. This is the first kind of grip you're going to use. It's opening the first finger on your control hand, or dropping the centre finger down. Most people favour one of these two grips. I would recommend trying both of them out to see which one is more comfortable for you. This is the one finger grip. I'm going to show you this from all sides so you understand where it sits. And this is the dropping the middle finger grip. You can see it makes like a little cradle in the middle of your hand. Ultimately our hand's going to be a bit flatter, but have a go at both of these first. Now, from the back of our hand we're going to throw the contact ball up to the side, pivot from our elbow and catch the ball flat on the back of our hand and repeat. So we're going to go up and catch on the flat and back onto the back of our hand. This takes a lot of practice to get controlled, so before we can really move on, practice, practice, practice this bit until you can comfortably catch it on the back and front of your hands. Eventually what's going to happen is as we do the throw, we're going to keep our hand underneath the ball, so if I show you in matrix vision here, it will roll in between the gap in your fingers. And we give a little push up at the very top of the throw and the ball will begin with practice to roll across your hand. Take this very slowly, take baby steps. It does take a long time to get the hang of the wave. Now if we throw our other arm in underneath with a bit of practice, you can see that it starts to get the idea of floating across the back of our hand here, and forth, and back. Of course, just to be annoying, you do have to learn your other hand as well. So whichever one you start in, learn it with the opposite hand afterwards. Contact juggling is very much about using both sides of your body and both hands left hand and right hand in this. Uh, before we can move on to the trick we're about to hear which is the butterfly, I would thoroughly recommend you get the hang of the wave in both hands. The butterfly rolls across one hand, off the back of the other, we collect it and then open our hand out to the other side. Effectively you're doing a wave in both hands, we're going to wave in, transfer, wave out, wave in, transfer, wave out. And you can see when you repeat the move here you get the butterfly which does this lovely floaty circle thing in the middle. I think that's probably enough for this tutorial as getting the wave butterfly will take you a fair while. I'd like to say thank you very much for watching Mr. Paul's tutorials from Kinetic Circus Workshops. For more information, connect, w, uh, connect with us at www.kineticworkshops.com. Subscribe to the YouTube channel for more news and updates. Thank you very much and cheerio!